What is up YJF and welcome back to our channel with some more Mushoku Tensei. This time we are continuing on with two more episodes, because why the fuck not? The first season is 11 episodes, so if we do two episodes per reaction we will be able to catch up quickly. And yeah man, with that being said, last episode nothing too big happened. It was just really getting reincarnated into a new world. And it seems to be the usual type of shit, with a medieval style of world and all, and magic in it. And yeah. What else? Some questions arose, for example, does Rudy know how to use other types of magic? Well, will he actually be able to use other types of magic? Is the more correct way to ask. Because yeah, he used water type of magic. So I'm not sure if he'll be able to use fire or some shit like that eventually. Or earth or something. I don't know, we'll see. With that being said, let's just jump straight into the reaction and let's see what those two episodes have in mind for us. Let's get it right now. Oh, interesting, so they are actually showing us some elements of his previous life. Well, straight from the get-go, I gotta say, this fucker, whoever the fuck he is, if he is rude, then god damn it. But yeah, this fucking room stinks, his entire life stinks, it seems like. The fucker doesn't know how to clean. Jesus Christ. So, is this supposed to be Rudy? Yes, yes, it is supposed to be Rudy. God damn. Okay, so he can use sword magic. This answers my question. But Rudy was a fucking loser in his previous life, it seems like. Oh lord. Jesus Christ, so yeah, that fucking side of this show is showing up. Which I might have to censor, obviously. Cause yeah, YouTube has guidelines and shit. It's been six months since she got here, okay. Yeah, Rudy is a goddamn pervert. Jesus Christ. Oh, so they have demons. G excuse me, what? You're a demon? Hmm, huh, interesting. You are surprised to my heck or... No, 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 wait a second. Yeah, you're a demon. Okay, I didn't get this wrong. So your hair color represents your race, I'm guessing. Okay, we're getting to the interesting shit. Straight in episode 2, wars and shit like that, history. Emerald green hair. They will kill you most likely. Yep. Yeah, he's... 40 years older than you, fuck. Actually, 30. I'm guessing. Of course, of course, he's peeping. It's been about a year, Jesus, they just skip past six more months just like that. Also, yeah, it seems like he can use fire now as well, so yeah. The thing I was concerned about was answered. He can use all types of magic. Okay, he has fucking... Jesus Christ, what in the actual hell? Yeah, his previous life sucked. Still though, I won't feel bad for Rudy, cause yeah. Okay, so it's good to know that they are not racist. Then again, this was back in the medieval times. Race didn't really matter that much back then. 
No, medieval in terms of this place. I don't think it will ever advance to the same level our civilization is advanced on since they have fucking magic, so why the fuck would they need technologies? It's been a year and a half, so they are skipping six more months. Jesus Christ, time sure flies by with this series. You become an adult at 15, so it's easy to understand. Interesting. So it's not 18. Jesus Christ. Paul, what in the hell, man? You just swallow that sword. Hey, yo. His first weapon, I'm guessing. Yep, a real sword. A magic wand. Huh. Do you need to use that stone in a wand, though? I'm actually curious, can you put magic stones inside of a sword, let's say? And use your magic on the sword that way. That would be a good combination. I, I still think that it would be a good combination to combine swordsmanship with magic. But yeah. I don't know if this is a thing that happens in this world or not. Because from the way Poe is acting, it doesn't seem to be actually a thing. With the way he's describing magic and all. Like saying it's not that useful in a close combat. Jesus Christ, his yeah, his fucking classmates sucked. Like for you. Okay then, so far nothing too bad is showing up in terms of Rudy's personality. Like yeah, he is a dumbass. Let's say he's a dumbass, if nothing else. He's still a pervert and all. But nothing too bad has shown. For now. Like yeah. His previous life was shitty. You know shit Roxy is pretty you know. And she is helpful to them. Like, they have no fucking reason to be looking at you right now. You are just a child. Will he be able to do it though on the first channel? Are we doing it away from people because it's a secret spell? No. Oh, okay. Is this lightning magic? Or am I tripping? Yeah, that seems to be the case. Jesus. Oh yeah, healing is actually useful. The poor horse. God damn. I feel bad for the poor animal. Jesus. It didn't do anything wrong. Are you sure it's a good idea to make Shruti perform this spell like? I'm pretty sure you've used it before and still you hit something you didn't want to hit. So what if... Okay, never mind. She's using her mind. She casts some kind of a barrier or some shit to protect herself. Jesus. Oh yeah, he was successful on his, on his first try, so... It seems like Roxy... Has nothing left to teach him anymore. Also, how much mana do you have, my guy? Like, you are not down after using such a huge spell? No, I'm not sure if it's really that huge of a spell, but still. Considering that you are a five-year-old. It's a creed level water mage. Okay. So I'm guessing now he has to t yeah, he has to study the other elements or something like that. Or I'm guessing Actually, it would be more reasonable to go to a magical school or whatever the fuck it was that she mentioned earlier. Well, that was actually pretty fast. I didn't think she would leave so soon. Like, I thought she would stay for at least 
two or three more episodes. I don't know. Time sure does fly by in this anime. Doesn't. Jesus Christ. Why? Yeah, he's weird. I'ma give it I'ma give that to him. He is weird as fuck. Anyway, let's jump into episode three. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I fucking love the world so far. And we've only seen one village, I think. Nothing too big. Just the fields and the village. And now we're seeing the forest as well. Jesus Christ, it's beautiful. Yeah, man. This series really makes me want to play some sort of a fantasy world game. Jesus Christ. Peasants, not, not a rock. Put that shit down. Green hair? Green hair, yeah. Yeah, it's good that I pay attention to this. So he's one of those. Oh, never mind. Wait, is he an elf? What's up with those ears? My is just helpful. So considering he has a green hair, if hair does play as much of a role in this as I think it does, he is a half elf and the other half is part of that race, which Roxy told him not to go near to. We'll see. It may not be as simple as that, but still, that's what I'm getting so far. Mm. Jesus Christ, Rudy. I was about to say, Rudy, you are an asshole if you really want to make friends with him just to use him later down the line. You know, about what he said, to get some girls around him. And Jesus Christ. Magic? So I'm guessing his parents never taught him about magic and shit. What's the reason though? Isn't magic like a commonly used thing in this world? Hmm, there must be some sort of a reason. Interesting, his parents actually seem nice. Hmm. Because you are back this late? Oh, that. He's not making up excuses though. Well, shit. I'm not surprised though, once again, this takes place in medieval times and shit like that. Yeah, for a reason though, he was acting like an asshole. Jesus, Paul, you sick as a father.
That's fair. Damn, gotta hand him to Rudy though. In this exact moment of time, he's acting mature. Then again, I'm nowhere near catching up with this series. So yeah, I don't know what will happen in the rest of the... How much is left? Fucking 13 episodes, yeah, I think, so far. So we'll see, maybe Rudy will end up doing something horrendous later down the line or not, I don't know. But so far it seems like he's just a pervert and that's the worst. Nothing else that's too bad about him for now. Wait, what do you mean like you did? Did Paul run away from his household when he was a child? I mean, your father is good looking, so yeah, it would be normal for them village hosts to come looking for him. Oh, still. Nice. God damn, he can use ice magic. Because he's talented, I guess. I'm actually curious. Will he be able to do it as well? I'm pretty sure no one in the world can do this type of shit. Like teaching something you you do only by feeling it. Because yeah, you don't know the theory and shit. Hmm, interesting. So yeah, Sylv can do it as well, huh? With some more training, he can get on the same level as Rudy. Don't tell me Sylph is a girl. Is he a girl? Yeah, by the way... He... He is behaving. It seems like... Yeah, that's not the problem, Rudy. No, Jesus Christ, you're just kids. That's not the problem. Think of it. Think. Use your brain. He was a she. <laughs> and the fucking lightning in the background. Jesus Christ. No, the fuck you want? He's five, Jesus Christ, bro. Jesus. Rudy, act normal for fuck's sake. What did he say? Maybe you should grow your hair. Jesus Christ. Rudy, you suck at communicating. No, don't go there. Don't go there. Yes, yeah, see, that's a weird concept though. Because you may be five in terms of physical age, but mentally you are fucking 45 at this point of time. Oh, wow, you have a fucking brain, Paul. Wow. Seems like there is no end credit scene. But wow, I'm surprised, Paul has a fucking brain. He said, what am I teaching my son at this age? Wow. He can use his brain. Yeah, Poe is a bit of a weird character so far for me. I don't know if I like him or not. He doesn't seem like the best of parents, you know. He's trying his best, but still. He's not actually succeeding. He doesn't give the best of advices. Honestly, his advices kind of suck. Because, just think a bit. Rudy is fucking five. Do you really need to give those kind of advices to him? Ah, <sighs> fuck. 
Yeah. Another thing I want to mention is Rudy's previous life. It seems like Rudy was one of the biggest losers I've seen in anime. Well, actually, one of the biggest ones I remember, because obviously I've probably seen other ones, but I don't remember them in the top of my mind right now. Doesn't matter that much. Uh, what else? My question was answered. Rudy can use all kinds of magic. Yeah, as I was about to say, I don't know if Sylvie will end up playing a big part later on down the line or not. If she'll keep appearing. Or if it's some, at some point of time she'll just disappear out of the story like uh, fucking Roxy did in the second episode. Though I'm not sure if she'll return, that's what I'm saying just right now. What's in my mind. Uh, what else? Am I missing something? So far, I was annoyed when Paul slapped Rudy. Also, I was surprised, but not at Paul, I was surprised at Rudy, because he was acting mature. Like Jesus. From the way you guys described him, I didn't think I'll ever see this out of Rudy, so yeah. So far, three episodes in, I don't know how bad things will end up turning later down the line, but for now, in those three episodes, I think Rudy is just a weird ass guy, but he's not as bad as you guys are making him out to be for now. I'm not saying later down the line. Maybe my opinion on him will change, but three episodes in, I think he's just a pervert and, and nothing else. He has his good sides and his bad sides. He's just uh, a weird ass guy. But yeah, I don't think what Paul did was right. He should have listened to Rudy first instead of uh, going straight into violence. But it seems like this is his character, because yeah, he prefers swordsmanship over magic, though magic has shit ton of uses and all, and I'm. I kind of think it's way more useful than swordsmanship. And I still think it would be lit if Rudy ends up combining using a sword with his magical stone and basically combining his swordsmanship with magic. But yeah, man. That's about that. Am I missing something? Hmm. Oh yeah, another country was mentioned, though briefly, which interested me a lot. And yeah, I feel like playing a goddamn RPG right now, cause... Jesus Christ. Whatever, man. Yeah, on the topic of RPG, by the way, since uh, the video is almost over, I gotta plug it in somehow. Uh, check out my Twitch if you want to. From time to time I play video games over there. Like, uh, I recently started playing Deltarune and I'm about to finish it soon. Yeah. Though I'm playing mostly old star, yeah, old, mostly old school games since my PC is weak and it can't handle streaming anything too big. That doesn't matter though, still. Follow it and check out my streams from time to time if you like it. It's chill community we have over there. And yeah man, also my Discord is a thing, if you feel like it, join it as well. And I also have a link to my Twitter. All of those things I just mentioned are linked down in the description below and in my channel as well. Anyway man, with that being said, time to end the reaction here and I'll see you guys in another reaction video on the channel. Bye bye!